Hi, this is Jason, and welcome back to 2015, the year I got the runs. So here it is, the first week of January, and I've run my first race, the Commitment Run. I have my new bid number up on my wall, and I have my new shirt. But with this race being over and it being the new year, I really have to plan for the next 12 months and decide which races I'm going to be running. I'm going to be a little bit selfish this year because I want to have some swag when I get done running with my running my races. So I tried finding races that have finisher medals, but it's a very time-consuming process to figure out what races give medals to everyone and which races just give medals to the winners of age groups and the number one male and number one female of a race. Basically I had to go and do multiple searches, uh, finding names of races for our areas, uh, go onto the websites, look at the information, scroll through all the um, verbiage to see if they give finisher medals. So what I did is I, I actually created a spreadsheet and this is what I've come up with. As you can see, I've kind of broken down the calendar into months, and I've also broken it out into the date, name of the race, the website, so I can easily go back and register. And finally, I created the last column where I put in the number of miles and it adds it up here at the bottom because I really want to make sure that I run my 50 miles. But what I started noticing is the top half of my year is really jam-packed and the bottom half is pretty empty. And one of the reasons why is at the end of the year there's a lot of fun runs and they don't give medals for finishers. So I'm really going to have to try to figure out which races I want to run in and which ones I don't. But what I might end up having to do is either run over 50 miles or just kind of take it easy at the end of the year. But that kind of defeats the purpose for uh, spreading this thing out over 12 months and for doing these videos for you. So I'm going to um, post somewhere in my comments the races that I'm, I'm tentatively planning on running. So if anyone here in Kansas City wants to join me, they're free to. Um, I'm going to be updating this list over time, so um, as for now, it's just a work in progress. If anyone has any suggestions of nearby races, uh, I welcome the recommendations. Um, but in the meantime, please like this video, please subscribe to this channel, and please keep watching, because as you know, 2015 is the year I got the runs.